promptly. The king's red. No coin. Honor's the prize. You mentioned some. For certain! Sounds like death. We be honored. A witcher with Ashy is chasing. What's that you say? Me, uh, nothing. Good. Get that cripple out of there! <laughs> Could chase his own wench into a. Watch my movement, Shani. I'm spry as a cat and sly as a fox. I'll show these imbeciles how one chases a porker. Come on, piggy. Got a nice and cozy pen for you. You see that, Shani? One big pen. Peasants, learn. Master Witcher, we ain't seen your family had an ample pet. My family had many. However, it were, the crowns go. And the king's chosen maid deserves a fitting favor. Yeah. Just don't go hiding it in some pouch. Brandish it on your horse so that all folk may see. What do you say to that, Shani? Ever witnessed such agility? <laughs> You're clearly a natural at chasing pigs through muck. You were a joy to watch. How does my heart's captor... The rag-stuffed piggy? <laughs> mm, tell me, Shani. What's the key with you? What do you mean? I'm on the prowl. That's clear. I woo and woo, yet you do not succumb. So I can't help but wonder, what am I doing wrong? Mm, perhaps you're just not my type. Considered that? Rubbish. I'm every lass's type. Is that so? Prove it. With pleasure. Show me a lass. And I'll have her eating out of my hand in the blink of an eye. Uh, that one, with the garland. Splendid choice. Now, who have we here? Do I know you? That's the crux of it. We've not met. An entire lifetime, more like. A moment, my dear. Do not sabotage me, Shani. I would not be fair. <laughs> fine, fine. I'll stay out of your way. Did it hurt terribly, my sweet? What? When you fell from the heavens. <laughs> Why, sir? <laughs> Shh, my dear. No more words. I shall make a true lady of you. Arm in arm, we'll grace the finest salons. Salons? Really? Actual salons? In Novigrad? And how... <laughs> in Novigrad? Oxenfurt? Why, in Kovir as well? Wherever you wish. Let's make haste to the barn. There, everything will be made clear. Leski. Step away from the man. Who the devils are you? We're the Mrs. Brothers, and we swore to our down his dying day we'd keep those of you. Easy, lads. No. Nope. We all heard your innocent talk. Wanted... Naturally, we would speak, but first we would dance. Find another beauty, or I'll dance. Get it. You saw it. I tried to resolve the theory, your stones. 
That's the last plowing. Calm down, boys. Don't want to fight you. Too dumb, bud. Cause that does it. Show us what you got. Hot damn, boy. You needn't ask me twice. Fence boards. A perfect Ow. weapon for sweaty ass swine herds. Perfect fit. <laughs> Never in my life have I reveled so fiercely. Step up. Who else wants a shave? And cretin creamed me. Embarrassing to take a licking from a boy. And with a maiden watching. <laughs> Had enough peasant spawn? Not yourself up. Away with you, big where to, my love? Don't. You must explain I was not at fault. In your dreams. There it is. You always that charming and... It worked. Listen. Tongue and fists on a leash from now on. Have your fun. Fine. Uh-oh. You made this mess, you... Oh. <sighs> your methods... A hazard of the trade, but point out the next year. You've proven everything. Ah, <sighs> fine. Ah, <clears throat> so good to shake the kinks from one's bones. We must find more, more fun. I'll leave you for a moment. As a bridesmaid, I need to be by the bride for the cat. Go on, Shani. I'll manage fine alone. Ladies and gentlemen, this night I've tasted of life's delights so fiercely, I've decided to make a speech. Geralt, there's no need. Till now, I'd always considered peasant jollities unworthy of it. I delighted in the beauty of buxom fa farmhands are a different story. Never took any... For one must live by... But this day... This day has changed all. You've still shite all to talk about. It's almost midnight. Wait, I'm not done. Oh, yes. You're a maid too. Midnight chime has struck the cap. A lovely custom. Blushing maids twirling in dance, their hair swirling freely, 
Their bodice is undone. They're bouncing. Will you stop? Did you see it? Shani caught the garland. She'll be next to marry as peasant superstition has it. Maybe. Doesn't matter. It's past midnight. Time for you to go back to the crypt. I can't! I'm not finished here. It's past midnight. You can take off those lovely ears. Only if you want to, of course. Lovely as they are, think I'll put them away for now. Is Vladimir's ghost gone? You see? She asks after me. Misses me already. I'm here, my ever-loving tulip. That kiss as we danced made my head so light. A team of hellish stallions could not tear me away before I receive one more. Or two more. Or as many as you'll give. You seem to have enjoyed yourself. I'm glad. A kiss. I knew it would end this way. An end that is but a beginning. No, it's just an end. It's after midnight. Your time has come. Ah, we needn't fret such trifles. Death's not come to claw me back, so why not continue our revels? What's Geralt think about that? You gave your word. Shani, darling, I'm dead. Can't expect too much from a corpse. Vladimir von Everick, go back whence you came. Please. Stay out of this. Stop! I beg you! Stop! Get ye hence, or I'll take you with me, and your moldy crypt will look like paradise in comparison. The choice is yours. Don't torture him. I promise he'll not die. <laughs> Gods, what is this? What did you do to him? Sent him back whence he came. I hope you didn't hurt him. I disposed of a pest. There was no need for you to suffer his cheek any longer. Geralt had finished his task, you see, so... Yes, I know. As soon as he finishes one task, he needs to rush off to the next. Who knows? Perhaps this time will be different. I saw you looking at each other, and it just so happens, I also know the history you share. You do? How? Shani, darling, would you ask an eagle how it knows how to fly? Regardless, what matters is Vladimir von Everett will bother you no more. I'd like to stay longer, but... Don't make excuses, Geralt. I'm not angry. A witcher has to ply his trade, follow his path. As for me, well, perhaps... Not sure I understand. Never mind. I should find out. Ah, there it is. The face of a man who's failed to understand a woman. You understand her? Of course. Women are simple. The problem is that men are hopeless fools. Your friend will now make a show of being hurt. Pick her some flowers or bring her a drink. She'll get over it in a snap. Rather manage without your advice, thank you. She cares for you. You have feelings for her. Don't overthink it. Surrender to spontaneous honesty. Nothing more beautiful in human relationships. You needn't end like Aldona and Jonas. Besotted fools bound by a con. Seize the night.